Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be updating your Mac. So on the top left hand side corner of your Mac you will see the Apple logo. Top left hand side, Apple logo, just click right there. Your third option will say App Store and your second option will say System Preferences. If you're almost up to date, most of your system updates will be right here. Your second option where it says System Preferences. On older Mac OS's, all your updates will be under your third option, App Store. But for now, we're gonna go right into system preferences. Under system preferences, we will see on the left-hand side, on the bottom, software update. So that's on the bottom, left-hand side, software update. So let's click right there. Once we click there, we should see this popping up. So this is the latest Mac OS update. If we click on more information, we should see this popping up, where it tells us a little bit about, about the update. However, there isn't much to read about it and it does require a restart. Every update actually requires a restart. This is only 2.96 gigs. So it does depend on your internet speed. However, although it's very small, for most of you, this will take about 20 to 30 minutes. It really does depend on your internet speed plus on your Mac itself. Anyways, right now I can just click on the bottom right hand side. It's gonna say install now or I can just close this. If I close that window where I got more information from, I can just click on the top right hand side where it says update now. Once I do that, it's gonna restart. What we're gonna see is a black screen, an Apple logo and a loading bar. So that's gonna go on for a few minutes until it's all the way through and done. Now before we go on and update, I wanna show you Time Machine. Now Time Machine is a separate video that I have to show you, but it's good to have that Time Machine backup done, which is something included on your Mac. It's not something you guys have to download, it's something already in your Mac. So make sure to have an external hard drive and set up your Time Machine, so just click on backup now in order to have that nice backup, which backs up in your entire system, including your apps and your files. Anyways, at this point in time, what I'm gonna do is just click on update now, it's gonna ask me to restart. So I'm just gonna click on restart. I'm gonna see the black screen. And after 20 to 30 minutes, we should see this and it's done. So it just had to restart. At this point in time, you should see your Mac is up to date with 10.15.6. And that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.